group of Mississippi teachers challenged the rising issue of state and standardized testing in public schools today by opening their own school to promote academic arts and community. Fox 23's Alyssa Cole took a trip out west to Macomb to learn more about the Jubilee Performing Arts Center for this week's Kindness in Action. Kindness in Action is brought to you by Forest General Hospital. is class at Jubilee Performing Arts Conservatory. I think it's effective for students to learn in free environments. And what creates the learning environment here is that they're free to learn. Dr. Terrence Alexander had a vision to break free and modernize education in the Deep South. He started teaching four years before I did, and as he was going through the process, he called me and he said, listen, I think there's more. I think there's more out there for the students. I think there's more for the community. I think there are things that we as individuals need to sow into the community, especially into the arts community. In 2009, with support of his community, Alexander successfully opened a private conservatory in the heart of Macomb, Mississippi. I'm a creative writing major and of course being a senior this year I kind of got to lead the other creative writers so I could um, you know tell them read this poem and we'll talk about it or whatever we get together a lot of time after school and we just like to write together which I think is really fun. Because of JPAC status students opt out of state testing leaving opportunity for genuine academic interest and growth. Right now on the true ACT with 100% of our high school students testing we have a 23 average and on our Aspire, we give a grade level equivalency and most of our students are scoring two to three grade levels higher than their actual grades. Students, faculty and staff describe themselves as family, always making a greater national and global impact each year. We'll be traveling to Australia next year. We just got an invitation to be in Australia. We also just got an invitation to participate in a Shakespeare music project project with 11 universities across the country. So there are great things on the way for our j -Pat. Alyssa Cole, Fox 23 News. If you want to nominate someone for kindness in action, go to forestgeneral.com slash kindness in action. For more information about j -Pat, you can visit their website at msmuseumart.org.